Brian Sheehan joins us live in Center City. Brian, we learned more information about the victim overnight. What can you tell us? Yeah, Aaron, this is a story that will likely shock anyone who lives or visits the city and is familiar with Love Park. Police tell us a 29-year-old man was shot and killed just before nine feet from that iconic statue. Here is what we know right now. An officer was on patrol not far from here when he heard gunshots. He rushed over to the park at the corner of 15th and JFK, where he found a man face down on the concrete with a gunshot wound to the head. Police rushed him to Jeff, where he died a short time later. Anyone who's familiar with this area knows how busy it is, so witnesses were able to help police figure out what happened in the moments leading up to the shooting. We're told several people witnessed the shooting. They told investigators the man was walking around the area for at least an hour before he was shot. However, it's unclear what he was doing. He was well dressed and did not appear homeless. That's what police are saying. As for the shooter, they told police it was a man wearing all black and that he was standing very close to the victim when he fired at least two shots. The shooter then got into a very specific Jeep and took off. Police hope the description of that Jeep helps them find the person responsible. We're being told it has green wheels, green lights possibly coming from the front, and green trim or a green front bumper. So there's a lot of green to this vehicle. And back here live, you can still see the two white chalk circles where those bullets likely ended up, again, just feet from the statue. As for the victim's identity, all police are saying is that they know who he is and that his last address is outside of the city. They also say they do not believe drugs played a role. But again, this morning, a killer is still on the loose and a motive remains unclear. We're live in Love Park. I'm Brian Sheehan, NBC 10 News.